Hey BBs, it's Plastic and today I'm back with y'all for another video. How are we all doing today? I hope we're all doing really, really, really fierce. In today's video, we're going doll hunting. We're hunting for Saran Claudine and Saran Cleo, the variants. Um, I don't know if I'll find anything, but Target's running a 25% off for one toy, so we're gonna see what's happening. So I tricked y'all, we're going to Walmart first, and immediately when I went to Walmart, I found the Bratz World display. They had the Kylie dolls out, Divas, like, it was cool to see the Kylie dolls. They had the Bratz World thing, they have all the new stuff, like, they had the blanket, I was really like, oh my god, I was gagged. I was gonna get it, but I didn't. They had the Bratz shirt, they had some makeup stuff, they had the brush set, they had these nails, which I've never seen before, ever. They're cool. Then walking down the actual doll aisle, I was looking for Monster High, but y'all, I found Disney LIYs, I was like, my mom, that's a Target, like, ugh, whatever. Um, the Little Mermaid is cool, LOL OMG section, you know, they had the Bratz Divas also in the regular section, they had the OMG dolls, I was looking at this one, the tween, cause like, oh, she's $12 at Target, they also had the head swap ones, which I was surprised about, they have a lot of new stuff in this Walmart, it's usually very behind, so I was super excited to see it all, um, they also had some Rainbow High dolls, they had Roback on the Shadow High Series 2 dolls, which was my first time seeing them in this location, they also had the Runway dolls and the tween things, Ruby, boo, Ruby, no one's buying Ruby dolls, they brought series again, four, five, whatever, three, I think, um, Prism, I really, really want, no, that's not Prism, there's the new ones also, they had Nunchalistas and the Flutter Girls, they had, this is where Monster High used to be, where is, and they had, like, the stupid sticker ones, this is my first time seeing them in real life, though. They were kind of cool. Just not for me. I just want the Monster High dolls. Where are the Monster High dolls? They had the Bratz, though. Here's, like, more of the end cap for that. They had some of the series dolls. I never, I haven't really, like, looked at um, Fiona too much, but she's cool, I guess, whatever. The new Dana variant, I guess. I don't know. Um, here's, like, the mini case, which is my first time seeing it in person. I don't know how much it even cost. Was it, like, $35? $30? I it can't. Um, series 1, though, and they had the mini advent calendar, which is, like, the repackaged one, which is kind of disappointing. Then, uh, Target. They had clearance on the mini Kylie's and the mini Bratz, usually. $5 for the mini ones and $3 for the Kylie's. I was gagged. Here's a little general view of the first aisle. This clip is kind of a mess in retrospective because I was holding a billion Bratz minis, but I took a better look. Here's, they had a random Crystal Bailey doll. Who brought this doll? And like, it felt like a time warm. Like, I, I had to, like, look at her. I'm like, what, what do you mean? I didn't buy her, but I was gagged. They had a lot of Rainbow High stuff. They had the new ones, the Shadow High. Um, a lot of the new ones. I didn't really... They had the new Barry one. I love her. Barry's so cool. Um, the Runway ones. They had the Hair Between, which is my first time seeing her also as well. She was cool. I didn't look at her too much, though. Lots of Rainbow High. There's my minis that I put down, finally. They had the, more tweens. I also really, really wanted Veronica. I was thinking about it. Or Victoria, because they had the 25% off. But I didn't buy her. I don't know. Next time. 25% off it'll last till November. So I'll think about it. Then we have to go back and hunt for the Monster High dolls. I also took a little trip down the LOL Izzle aisle. Um, they had, the they, you know, a, a lot of tots. Lots of tots. Not much OMG dolls, which is kind of upsetting, because... I don't care about the tots, but lots of tots for the tots girls, you know, the flying ones, the tween heads, the swapping styles, the, the sunshine ones, you know, and then we went back to the monster high doll aisle so I can give y'all a better look because I looked, I was like, girl, I cannot, I just like went there and I scrimmaged through everything and I couldn't find what I wanted and then I just like gave up, but then I went back to the aisle. There's a monster ball also on sale. The craft things were there, I guess, I don't know. Does anyone buy the craft things? They had fabulous pets, which is cool. My dad bought me that, not that one, but like he bought me one of them. Um, then I took another glance at the Rainbow High Dolls in case I missed something. Um, but I don't know. They're cool. Love the Rainbow High Dolls. And then there's me walking through Target with my dolls. And we're all back from our shopping adventure today. It wasn't anything like crazy or anything. Like they weren't like stocking shelves with the new things. But it was really cool to see my Walmart participate in like the whole Bratz thing. I forgot to scan that. AR code. I'll have to look back in the video if I ca captured that. But I know like the Walmarts, like they're doing this like AI experience Bratz World thing, which gags me. Like I'm excited about that, but I'm like, surprised because my Walmart is always super behind on everything. So the fact that they have that out and ready by now is like insane to me. I um, mean, it's my first time seeing that. I've been watching everybody's videos, everyone's posts about the Bratz World at Walmart, and I've been super gagged about it. And I'm super happy that I was able to obviously just experience it in person. I didn't really buy anything from that from the Walmart at all. Um, I definitely want to wait maybe for like a Black Friday sale or just for like my birthday or something because I've been buying so many dolls recently. I definitely want to get like the makeup brush set um, in like the, the throw blanket. I feel like I have so many brat shirts like I'm already wearing one, one right now, the Pretty and Punk one from the Cider Collection. Um, it was a really, I love this shirt, y'all. I wear this all the time. But, like, isn't it cute? Um, there's no Sasha on it, though, which is kind of upsetting. But Sasha's art for Pretty and Punk is kind of ugly, so I'm like, whatever. She's, like, just standing like that. Well, okay, off topic, but it was cool, again, to see Brat stuff. And I haven't really been 
And not that I'm not in a Bratz because I'm always going to be in a Bratz. Like, Bratz is definitely like a staple doll for my collection. But it was cool. Like, I'm really into Monster High right now because it's like October to see like Bratz stuff all over the place. Um, so like that was just stellar. They moved though Monster High out of that Walmart, which I try like I if you I think I I'm, I'm gonna mute the clips and like voice over them, um which you'll already see what you know whatever. Um, they, I think they took Monster High out of my Walmart, which is upsetting because I was looking for Saran Claudine, which we obviously did not find sadly. The um Target I spent like a good couple minutes like looking through every Claudine, looking at the batch codes and looking at the hair blends, and they're all polypropylene. Same with Cleo. Next time, though, but they did have Monster Ball on sale, so if any of y'all need to, they can check them out and price match, maybe, with my picture or whatever. Um, but we did get, actually, some really cool things from Target. Bratz had, they had the minis on sale, like, randomly. They had no Bratz stuff in that Target, but the Bratz minis, but I got two of, actually, I'll have a picture on screen of how much I paid for them all, because that'll probably be easier if you guys want to price match them to your store, so that's there. But um, just for my sake, I, ha I got two of the Series 2 minis. They're each $5, which I thought was a really good deal. And we can open them in a minute. But um, $5 for each, which, again, they usually cost $10. I'm sat. And then they had the Kylie dolls. They had the Kylie minis. I got three of these. Um, I don't really want all the Kylie collection because I... I don't know. I just don't know if I like, need them all, but I got three of them. And I used it for both these things. I used placement charts from Pancake Boss and maybe Lookin' Bratz. I'll have those linked in the description below if y'all want to check out which dolls you want to get. But these are $3. And I got the original packaging and I got the new packaging, which I was super excited about. Um, and I hope that what's in them is what was said to be in them from like the placement guide. But obviously, things can move around in store and everything. I thought it'd be kind of fun if we open these together just because like... I feel like these are kind of old a little bit. I guess they're already on clearancing and everything. And like, I don't, I don't know. I wouldn't want to sit through a two minute video of me opening Kylie Mini Bratz dolls. So we're just gonna do it now. Um, but $3 for these is kind of crazy. Um, but this is different packaging than these ones actually. I really have not paid attention to the Kylie Mini Bratz dolls. I only really cared about the, um, the main ones, like the big ones. And I have those and they're cool. They, I think the one that holds up better in my collection personally is the Day Out look, which is like the shorter look. But um, the night one is cool too. Um, but it's crazy again, $3 for like the minis. And I'm not like the biggest mini person or anything. They're fun, but I'd rather just get like the big Bratz dolls. Like that's why I'm not like super into them. I think they're a little bit expensive too. Oh, that was satisfying. Not really, but I like the sound. Uh, I'm just not super into the minis. I don't know. But we have this pink packaging and it says Kylie on it. And inside we have the like, um, the bag, which is Kylie colors or the Kylie, um, phone print thing. And let's see what's in the first bag. Okay. Ooh, I don't know if I wanted this one, but I got her. This is the one from the night look, which is actually really, really cool. Cause now I can oppose her with the, the big one. Oh my God. And I'll do a better close on my desk if y'all care about it. We have this one. Okay, so I think the placement guide worked because I wanted the rope. I like that I remember wanting the rope but not the doll, but this is going to be super cool if I, like, take them out of box and, like, I can just, like, pose them with each other, like, the rope. Um, but the boxing is kind of... Oh, my God, that's kind of crazy. This is the final packaging. The, the one that I'm opening, is that the final packaging? No, I'm... This is, like, the day packaging. But we also get more of this. We get a poster here. Do the regular ones come with the poster? Oh my god, it's the selfie one. I'm actually gonna put this on my room in my on my walls. And then we have the other ones we can get. I think I was looking for the one with like the um the day look, and I wanted maybe I think it was this one, the Met Gala one, and I wanted to get like the lip phone in the car as well. So we're gonna have to look for those. But that's cool. I like the poster. Like I love the posters. Like this is very very brats to me. I love that. Um, I'm gonna open though one of these ones. Okay. I'm going to open up one of these ones next. These are just the regular ones. But these are Series 2. And I actually did get one of these with my friend um, a couple weeks ago when they first released. We got, like, just for full price. But for $5, I'm more sad for that. I think, again, the $10 is a little bit expensive just because, like, they're two minifigures. But hopefully the, place the placement guide worked. Okay, so we do get a poster with these ones. Oh, oh, but it's just, like, the checklist. I'll look at that in a minute. But let's see who we got first. And this is just, like, regular packaging. It's nothing like Kylie's. And we got... Oh, yeah. Okay, so this one worked. This is Megan Express It. And I was really excited about this one. Because I don't think I have any Megan minis. I might... I don't think I have Megan or Dana. Actually, I could be completely wrong. But that's cool. So that means this one. This one is gonna be... Rock Angel Sasha! I love this! Oh, my God. 
Rock Angel, oh, she's wonky, but that's, oh, she's a mini. Rock Angel Sasha has been one of my favorite Bratz dolls in the entire world recently, and I, I don't even know why, because I have her reproduction, I don't even have her original one, but, oh my god, I'm so, her, she is, like, really wonky in the packaging, look at her eyes. Is my Megan, my Megan already fell out of my bed. No, she's better, but, oh, I'm so happy about this. I want it, again, $2.50 each. I kind of wish I got more now, because I'm really excited. I definitely have more of an attachment to, like, the regular ones than, like, the Kylie ones, because I'm not, like, the biggest Kylie fan, but, oh, I'm so happy about this. That's the diva. So, let's open, I guess, another Kylie mini. I don't know. Again, I have a couple. Ugh. And I'm probably not gonna, after I get, like, if I get all the ones that I want from the Kylie minis that I, like, picked out from the placement guide, I probably won't be getting any more Kylie Bratz minis, because I don't really, like, again, want the whole collection. But I definitely am interested in buying the rest of Series 2 if I go back to that Walmart in a couple weeks and, like, they go down a little bit in price, maybe. Or maybe even for, like, some Friday, see, like, Black Friday deals. Maybe we'll have some more chances. Okay. Same packaging. <gasps> yes! It's the, the, um, her face is good on this. This is the Met Gala look, or I think, yeah, I think this is Met Gala. Her face is stunning. She actually looks a lot better than, like, her actual doll in this mini. Oh, I'm so happy about this. Okay, so then what is this one? I hope I don't get the dog, to be honest. That's the one that I was, like, steering away from. We have the, oh my, we have the lip phone. We have the lip phone. We have the lip phone. I love the lip phones. <gasps> I've been wanting another lip phone so bad because I have I have the one from series one of the Bratz Minis and like it's fun but I want to have another one so like they can like across the room they could be like calling each other on like the Bratz Minis phones and I never keep these in box so I'm excited to open this. We'll probably open them in a minute. Let's do the last Kylie Mini and then we'll go on to the series one as a finale because I'm hoping that one is the one that I want but um I hope it's the one that I picked out. Last Mini. I'm excited and ex yeah for this one. Okay. Okay, placement guide, please be real, please be true, and please be everything I need. Oh no, it's not! I got another one. Wait, what does this mean then? Oh, it's another rope. No, we got doubles! For $3, though, it's fine. But I really, really wanted the, um, the night look. So maybe someone, like, messed around with the packaging. No, that is so upsetting. Oh well. We let's go on to the last... The last capsule. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Please be good. Oh, it's not the one that I picked out, but it's good. It's Yasmin. I wanted Kiana, but that's okay. I actually have girls and I Yasmin. And what is this going to be? Oh, it's the car. Okay. Um, I think the best one that I pulled is definitely Sasha. And I'm actually really excited about um the night look as well. So that was fun. I think for $20, I got a bunch of Bratz minis. Like, that is so exciting. Okay, so that was a cool... I guess I'll bring y'all to my desk. If you, if you guys want to see these up close. Yeah, I'll do that quickly. And then we can end the video off. If you ignore the desk being a mess, let's look at some of these stellar dolls. Like, she's a little bit funky-licious, but that's okay. We also have the lip phone, which I'm excited to take out. We have the girl sent out Yasmin, who is actually a little bit messy, too. But it's cool to kind of have her, because just Yasmin's, like, right on my desk. It's cool to have them together, you know? Hello? Like, look at how cute they are! I'm actually really happy that I got girl sent out Yasmin, because I actually kind of love her doll as well. Here's the cruiser. Which is actually nice as well, because, like, I don't really want, like, the Bratz cars. Like, I think I don't have enough space for cars anymore in my dog collection, so, like, having a mini version of it, it's nice. I do have that one limo from the, um, FFM Cruiser, or whatever it's called, from the lim the Formal Fung line. I'm kind of over having it. It's kind of really big. The little rope. We have the night look of Kylie, who is also right over here. Very Kylie Bratz day today, though. I love them. I love the Kylie dolls. And we have Express at Megan live for this and here is the stunning 
I wish they made this in like the normal size Bratz doll because I actually love this look a lot from Kylie. But I'm probably not going to keep any of them in the boxes because like the boxes are like kind of ugly. But yeah, that was kind of my haul for today. Thank you guys though so be much for watching today's video. It was so much fun with you guys and I cannot wait to catch all though in the next one. Love you all endlessly and I'll see you very, very soon. Love you. Bye. Mwah. From Kylie. <laughs>